Have you ever had a massage? Yeah. yeah so like, listen, I, do you know every time I go in a massage, when they're doing the massage, I never relax. All I'm thinking about is, this is going to be over soon. This is uh, going to be over uh, soon. Ah, now you've got to lose yourself. Yeah, 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 time, bro. Yeah. You have problems relaxing in general, Big though, time. You, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. That's one of the most relaxing experiences. Yeah, yeah. and I'm and just you're thinking, saying, I'm oh, big... I like this, but it's going to be over soon. Yeah, I, I, yeah. yeah. girl was about this tall, and she come in and she was like, uh, do you want uh, medium, soft, or hard, or whatever? And I said, <laughs> I bet you went hard. hard. Yeah. <laughs> I said, hard. Beat you up. So, you know, when they like lift up your legs and they push yeah, you and yeah, all that? And I went, <laughs> oh no <laughs> man was dealing with the flatulence right, listen <laughs> we're on a silent no, and violent no no one. no she it, turned around she went loud and proud she went oh excuse me <laughs> really <laughs> For the rest of the me session, all I kept thinking about is, I can't believe I farted. Uh -huh. I believe I farted. Uh -huh. And I couldn't get it out of my head. Yeah. Let's hope you didn't have beans on toast for breakfast. <laughs> I, had this, I, I had that this morning. In our industry, yeah, that's where the most hurt is, the most mm. pain. People are in out there every week, raving, taking things, going mm. out there, doing their thing, letting loose, escaping from their realities. Mm. Now, this is the market. Mm. That is the market to actually say, bruv, there's other stuff and you can't, won't stop listening to drum and bass or MCs or whatever yeah. just because you're doing this. Yeah. It would just help you with other things. Yeah. Yeah. Do you understand yeah. what I'm saying? And yeah. you can do things on a balance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Life's that's all, all about it balance, isn't it, man? Well, Everything's about it. balance. You know, you know, uh, just go, you know, obviously this this episode we're talking about is mental health and th that's a really good way of, cu you know, curing it. But there'll be certain things like, you know, what you mentioned well, earlier about the your mental light. health, isn't it? Yeah, it's that's protect what, that's what it's, it's, it's well, got mental health chill. as well. That's yeah. the thing Like I know people, friends that, all right, I'll give you an example. People that I know close just had mental health issues, but mm. they don't know they've got mental health until a later age. Yeah. And when yeah. you're over 30, they don't diagno diagnose you. Mm. So like, if not. you haven't never know, if, oh, you're, know if you've ever had it before and you go to the doctors like when you're 35 or 40 and say, mm. listen, I've got bipolar. I think like I'm up and down and mm. they just work because you, it, it, it's something that you've had for years and yeah. you've and they just and think like, you know it. what? Yeah. Right. But right. young people that go there, that they know go, so they would, mm. you know, straight mm. away they would, cause there's a, there's a, there's a thing that, that you know, anxiety and bipolar and all this mm. ADHD behavior. and all those ADHD kind of things. because yeah. that's yeah. a thing yeah. as well. It's very popular, like, you know, hyperactive. That's all it is. Do you mm. know what I mean? was like it. You see, mm. you see. Yeah. You know, but he, he was dealing with it. And if he never had his weed or whatever, he'd go mad or whatever. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And there was, mm. or there's certain things you can't do, like drink or certain things because it just don't connect with your mental health. Do you understand mm. what I'm saying? So mm. people learn about their self. Well, that shot says it's balanced, man. So Well, well what I was trying to get at was um, you see things like uh, Spotify and uh, Instagram, Facebook and all this, like with mm. the likes thing. Mm. You know, if you think about I think they should take all them stats away from the public to see because... Like the thing is, like you can hide your likes now on um, Instagram. I think, yeah, mm, I don't yeah. know if you could do it on any other. So Instagram are trying to do something, but you know, like, why do people do that? Why do they hide their likes? Um, probably, probably in case they don't get enough. Because right. the thing so, is, so if they, you so, get so, two thousand so, likes on a post and, and then, I get twelve yeah, yeah. likes on a yeah. post, that sends a message well, out so that you're it, more popular. So that's but, the, but how can then say, but say if you're a promoter. And you see someone's getting loads of traction. Yeah. Why the you you you're almost the person who's hiding it? You almost think, ah, oh, they're not getting very good traction because um, they, well, they don't want to show it. Well, Whereas if you, if, you get if you get hundred hundred thousand likes, you're gonna want people yeah. to see it, if, isn't it? If people, that's the, the thing. Like, some yeah. of my but like, I, I get you, mad but... likes on some posts and I will just leave it. And yeah. I think, Rah, but then it, the, you know, I think as well that people don't understand the Instagram thing. You only get a percentage of your reach anyway. So yeah. yeah, it's true. You could have like I got six almost sixty thousand followers, but. Do you know what I mean? Like that my percentage is probably like I'm reaching to about six hundred or or yeah. even, I don't know, twelve hundred. That's what people yeah. are telling me. Yeah. And you gotta to pay to get the reach and all this. So it's not but it is very down but, but the thing is, is like, you know, it would put make you feel down. So I'll give you an example, right? Like um years ago, like if if a lineup come out and I wasn't on it, I never used to get the hump. I'd always be like, Okay, I'll be on the next one. And mm. I I just in a way, I'm glad I had that now, like, because I think about when other people are not on lineups, like, you know, they might, you know, like previous lineups that I that I would know was going. Say, so even when we did Mike Masters, a couple of people called me like, bro, what's going on? Why didn't you reach out? And mm. like, I would just be like, oh, well, look, don't worry. It's just the yeah, first we'll one. We'll There'll be the more. One, yeah. 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 But the thing is, is you don't realize that these kind of things. It's they, they, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And what they yeah. do is it, it kind of. It chips away a little bit at everybody. And right. that's whether you're releasing music. Self-esteem and all that yeah. kind of things. So let's say, right, I'll give you an example. We released a record 
like Friday just gone. Um, you know, I think we'd done like in two days, like 11,000 streams. I was like, okay, that's really, that's quite mm. nice. I was quite happy with that. Yeah. And then Kinetic showed me some girl who's like released the record on the same day, 3 million streams. And I was like, damn. Yeah. He showed you in it that. Oh, uh, right. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. I was like, damn, 3 million streams. And like, she had like 7,500 people listening now. Yeah. It was on the thing. And I was like, rah. Like, yeah, but that don't, that don't, that don't like, take but, uh, away from what you've done. No, no, yeah. but but even me in my position still went raw. Yeah, yeah, Do you yeah. understand what I mean? Yeah, so think started. about someone, if I put up the 10, 11,000 streams in two days um, and then like someone's put out something and got 100 streams, they mm. might look at mine and go raw. So yeah. what it is, is... But I think it's, if do you see what I'm saying? I get, I get, get, what, I'm I get, I get what you're saying, but if you're a promoter, it's handy, isn't it? Like, yeah, for instance, you bro, can say, oh, look, man, man's got all these views on his... He must be like popular. Let's be real. Let's be real. Listen in 2023 there's very few people that are getting booked just off of their numbers it's all to do with who they're linked with how much stats yeah, the status yeah, they've yeah, got yeah. who they're it's, it's a it's whole a, different game now it's not yeah. like back in the day where you could you yeah. know you were linked with Brett Telepathy and yeah. Michael yeah but if someone and, does get a load of traction then normally the management will come in pick him up and then yeah but then what about the people that have bought likes what do you, why, how do you do that? Like, well, you can uh, buy likes. No, on there's there's art. I know you used to get have, fake followers on Twitter. Yeah, right yeah, people have done yeah, that. So then, what? So you, you so can then, normally see when it's fake though. Yeah, yeah but I, bro, I, like, I see man. Suddenly, man's got ten thousand more followers in a day. Like, yeah, well, no, but man the thing is, him. Yeah, yeah, the thing is, what I'm saying is that has happened over time. Even before anyone knew what the fake followers were, yeah, years ago, people were doing it. But anyway, they were doing it. Right, fair enough. They were clever enough to basically get ahead of the game before it become well known yeah i'll give you an example saying i only found out late lately and i was a bit like oh my god so basically um you know like when um like andy c made 31 seconds yeah he mm. took that sample do, 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 off of a cd and that was a free cd that was given out on um on like with a magazine like okay, a music yeah, mag. Yeah, yeah. you know brilliant he done it he done an amazing song still can play it to this day brilliant but back then and I only found this out recently. You know, like you've got Splice now where you can go and get samples. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There used to be like CDs that were sold for like 100, 120 pounds and it would have loads of samples on there. And you could use them for free. And you use them for free. Right. But what it is, it was only the top, top, top producers that used to buy it. So I'd be in the studio like trying to make sounds right. when these guys were just sampling them. Yeah. And I'm like, and I've only just found out yeah, well, now myself. It. It's the same with Spotify. It's the same with what you just... Meet people, oh, you listen, man, I can do that or whatever. But the point is, it's very disheartening in the music scene. And, and that's a good that's a good point. But that's what, what I'm is, saying. It's what are you doing as an individual? Yeah. Like, there's ways of looking at it. Like, if I'm not on a lineup or I'm not, I've got to work harder. Mm. But then sometimes it could be a block or it could be this or it could yeah. be that. But do you know what? I'm not going to let it ruin my day. Mm. No. That's the way, that's my attitude now. Yeah. But five years ago or 10 years ago, yeah. you know what I mean? When you ain't got a lot of work or things are going a little bit of a bad time because 30 right. years is a long time, but it's been up and down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And there's been times where I'm like, oh, I'm not on this, I'm rare, rare. And it, yeah. it does get me mad. And even yeah. now, I will get a little bit like, oh yeah, rare, rare, rare. But then it's what you're doing as an individual. Some yeah. man just go to the gym, pump up, bam, bam, bam. Do you know what I mean? And meditate, yeah. I feel good again. Do you get yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. other man might be taking gear or whatever or drinking or whatever. Mm. And it just going into a depression yeah, like bro, I'm not on this yeah. man hate me bro. Rira, what's going but that's what that's what I'm saying that's the that's, that's reality. what I'm getting at is I think it's easy for like for you to for anybody to kind of go oh it's your fault rather than actually yeah. look at yourself what Shab and said, go, like, work yeah. harder man do you know what I mean yeah. I've always find yeah, it but I know some people I'm, it's, it, it should be a form listen, of motivation there's certain, listen, yeah. certain events right that I, I, I that weren't booking me and I and instead of me like Going online and saying, "Oh, wait, wait, wait!" It isn't. I know there's a there's a problem, and you know, it, it, I would never do that anyway. Yeah. But I'm mm -hmm. saying, instead of me, do, I could easily do that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean, if I thought there was something and and could talk to the internet, but what's mm. that gonna do? No. All I do is reach out to a man, bam, bam, bam. Do you know what I mean? Maybe for a next man or even myself, and just say, "Look, I'm not too big." Do you understand yeah. what I'm saying? And then you mm. break the ice, and the next, oh yeah, we do this, and then you start popping up on yeah. things. Yeah. yeah. Do you understand yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not saying it's like that for everyone, no, but, but that's yeah. what I'm saying. Me personally, I'm a big art. I've been yeah. in the game years, and and, yeah. and people's like, oh, I can you hear up bad? I don't, I don't ramp, bro. It's a new day. It's a yeah. new dawn. Yeah. That's my attitude. Exactly. I want to work promoters, with you. New people, people yeah. get around you, and they might, they might be living off of old 
And then, and it's all right, he's all right, you know. Yeah, like, yeah. Wait, 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 you get what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah, 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 it, yeah. sometimes it's just a thing where men are not sure. Yeah. Do you understand yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah, other yeah. artists, like the younger artists, mm -hmm. should take that information. Do you know well, what I mean? And I, I think that you're right about that as well. As younger artists should just make sure you're being seen, make sure you're active. Yeah. If you're not putting out music and you haven't got no social media presence, yeah. you can't really moan yeah. about See, this not is, being online. This is, a, stuff. this is another thing, is, um, is the social media presence. So, like, there's an artist that I know, he's actually really good at what he does. Um, he actually has art, uh, people, a DJ supporting his music. He's had a couple of tunes with like uh, vocalists, uh, MCs and mm. that on it. Um, but he's finding it really difficult and he's out everywhere. He's like going out and me, but I know he's finding it difficult to get on shows or to get bookings and everything like that. And what it is, is a couple of times he's kind of like, I think I'm just going to knock this on the head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it wow. really, yeah, yeah. And he's only young as well. And I'm just like, bro, man, you've yeah. got a long time to go. You don't be yeah, knocking it on the yeah, head yeah, yet. Yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah. I, 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 listen, I've, I've come across many people like that, MCs. This if like, you think I, about how many, I always remember yeah. Dre, that line, yeah. I seen them come, I watched them go. Yeah. How many people have come into the, yeah. how many things, think about how many because people we've, over our career, we've met. Listen, yeah. that's, that's, that's his hill and his mountain, that he's got to, he's got to climb that hill. Mm. Well, that man, and everyone gets to a stage where it's not just easy. Nothing just don't flow in. There was times that probably MCs in the scene had bad times and they weren't going. And then all of a sudden things just turn around. Do you mm -hmm. get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you're consistent to it. You love it. It's in your heart. And yeah. that's all you know. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah, yeah. it's the way you deal with it. And I feel like that's the attitude you've got to have as a young guy. You can't be just like, oh, I'm going to give up because yeah. that's why you're not going to make it. bro. Yeah, yeah, Imagine yeah. giving up like that early in your career. You yeah. know, that Quincy Jones made Thriller when he was 50. Yeah. Wow. One of his biggest albums. Wow. 50 years old. Imagine he quit. Mm. 40. You ain't mm. getting Thriller. Yeah. Michael Jackson, one wow. of the greatest albums. There could be other things out yeah, there. Yeah, mad. Never quit, man. No, nah, nah, that's yeah. what I'll say. I like, do you know what? I've just. I'd put the head down and it's like, like a bull and just through the doors. You have to. So, you know what I mean? Quit. Quitters don't win, mate. That's just, that's, that's the true. Problem, man. But, you know, um, I mean? you know, like, I think. You know, like you, you've you've mentioned some because we're going to kind of wrap this up now. You've mentioned some really interesting things there with regards to, you know, finding your thing that that like you know sh we haven't even discussed shots like you run like during oh, the yeah. pandemic the pandemic man it was getting, know, getting that was down. your that was your thing it was, was running down bro. and, and you've carried and it on consistent. now you're consistent yeah, with yeah. I, see, I love yeah. it yeah. Gym, all the, every yeah. day you know what i mean he but writes it's, about it online it's, it's like, so good for the mental health yeah. Show. Yeah. i'm yeah. telling yeah. you yeah. 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 that's almost my form of meditation yeah. yeah i get out there and i really think about things on a deeper level it's just me out there got all these thoughts in my mind and piecing things together i come back and i feel good if i don't go gym or i don't run on a day i don't i don't have that same vibe yeah, bro yeah, the same yeah. thing you're talking about if yeah, i miss yeah it's like yeah, I, yeah. I need it now yeah, yeah. and that is like uh that is a uh, obviously a positive addiction to have do you know what i'm saying yeah. it's good for your mental health it's good it's for a, your physical health mm. it's good on all levels man well i think um you know another thing is um you know one of the things that i think this is just in general everybody's thoughts and everything can just run away with them and i think one thing um there's this uh there's this app called um oh my god what is it called now it's anyway it, i can't remember i'm so sorry if i remember i'll put it into the into the um into the the comment uh, you know the description mm. but um it's basically it, there's this one thing on it and it said what you've got to do is you've got to kind of like slow your, your mind down you know when your mind's racing with thoughts mm. you've got to slow it down because you'll be you have so many thoughts every second like right oh, I've got that, listen uh, Breathing exercise. That's what I was going to mention before. That's yeah. that's what I do as would well. That, would that calm your? Well, that's what it does. I, I've, I know breathing exercises. It's called tools, right? So you got you got tools. You could be in dry. You could be driving around in traffic or whatever. I got hand things I can do with my fingers that can calm my nerves. Yeah, mm. it's mad, bro. Mm. And the breathing exercise is the number one. So. If you're out there and you don't want to do mantras or you don't want to do meditation, try breathing exercises, right? Mm. That's what I do. Like you can Google it online and find it. Yeah, I did it. When I did the yeah. sound bath, I did, yeah. they did breathing exercises yeah. to kind of get you into yeah. the right kind get, of vibe. It gets your heart. Yeah, like, yeah, right? yeah. And you, like you breathe differently like, and everything's about breath. Mm. Don't get it twisted. All of us, we're all, our next breath is, is the most important thing. So mm. do you understand what I'm saying? Like yeah, you learn yeah, breathing yeah. exercises. I'm trying to look for the app. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what you're yeah, up to I'm over there. To look, I can't find it. You mentioned calm, yeah, and, and that is the thing to calm you down so Space. much. Headspace. That's the one. Oh my god, legend! It's called Headspace. Big up Brian, thank man. You. Yes, Brian. Big up our producer. <laughs> yeah, Heads Brian. Thank you so much. Headspace. Yeah. Well, honestly, when you listen to this thing, it just it proper calms you down. Yeah. And and one thing I got to what tell is you, it talking on music. Yeah, it's just a guy talking. This geezer, uh, like he yeah. just talks. But I got to tell you this quickly. Um, I, I see this the other day, and it actually works. You know, like when you wake up in the night, 
and like say so you get up go to the toilet and you go back and you, you're laying there and your main brain's going like hey, this guy or, or somebody said uh, what you got to do is like breathe breathe in for four so go breathe in for four and then hold it for six yes yes and then release that's, it for seven oh bro right bro and I'm it lowers your, four, six, it, lo eight, it lowers four, seven, <laughs> It, oh, it, it lowers your heart rate to below yeah, yeah, 60 yeah. and you fall asleep. That's and bro, it works. That's yeah. why I do four, seven, eight. So basically, no way. Yeah, you sat, sat, but I do sat, Saturnama. So basically, that's four. Like Saturnama means I am grateful. Yeah. But what it is, you just do that and you do Saturnama. For, and does that, that it, calms you right hold down? Hold it for six yeah. and breathe it out. For, and then when you're out breath, you think you're, and then I'll do a next one where I hold the out breath. Yeah. For like oh, one or two. So when you're out, you breathe everything out, and, yeah. then, you, and then you hold for two. So right. it's mad. Yeah. It's that like reverse, yeah. but it's a heart calmer. Yeah. And you see right. your heart. Speaking, yeah, and it does. And it calms you, bro. Yeah. And it, you can have mad thoughts in your head. And, bro, you're yeah. like, and they just go. Mm. And when that, when I thought, I thought I'm going to try, because my brain was going, I've got to do this, I've got to do that. Yeah. And then when I just thought, let me try this. Man, next thing you know, I woke up in the morning, I went, babe, that thing worked. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't believe it actually worked. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Th there is, you know, look, what, what I want to kind of say. you tired with breathing. That's what happens. You made yourself, you made your mind. just Bro, go, I just found this on YouTube. I don't even know how I found it. But yeah. um, what I've got to say is like, you know, everybody suffers with men. I mean, you know, look, we, we've, you know, we've not even, this is such a deep subject. Yeah. Um, You know, but what it is, is, you know, all, I want to say this there's always a way out. There's always a way at the mm. end of the tunnel, a light at the end of the tunnel. And don't like, try not to let your thoughts like um, rule you. You because, never want to internalize it. Yeah. It comes out in other ways. Yeah. That's yeah. what I've learned over the years. Yeah. If you hold yeah. stuff yeah. in, yeah. that's yeah. going to come yeah. out in ways yes. that make you not like yourself yeah. very much. Trust yeah. me. Whereas it's, if you talk to people, yeah. do the therapy. I do yeah. therapy through lyrics. Do you know what yeah. I mean? That's how I get yeah. a lot yeah. of my stuff yeah. out. Yeah. Bars, yeah. do you know what I mean? Yeah. But other people obviously deal with it in different ways. Yeah. So Arsh, never Arsh internalize, man. definitely therapy as well for yeah. us. Like when you're writing and you're creating and and then you get to express yourself. Do you know what someone said to me the other day? And I was like, I was like, right, okay. Okay, so I don't know if it's true or whatever, but they said um, they said that they think DJs and MCs have some form of isms and uh, ADHD. The, the MCs would kind of be have that ADHD where they're so well, no, they got to kind of like get their words out and they got to right. get their thing. And then with like, if you think about it, and the way she explained it to me, she went, "You've all got some sort of ism." And I was like, oh, "What do you mean?" And and then I said, "Well, I thought that after I watched um, that." Sheldon program the yeah. was it I can't remember the name of it now you were saying you do certain things that yeah, he does as that well. he does and I was yeah. like oh I never knew that yeah. but the thing is she said if you think about the the feeling you get when you're performing in front a of jelly, a crowd I yeah. work off a jelly so that you can become an Adrenaline junkie like, yeah. yeah like like when I drive home from Bristol and I've done two gigs or whatever yeah. and I'm thinking right like, I'm not going to get home I'm tired as soon as I do that set, I'm back oh yeah, yeah. my coffee yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah I'm flying yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I get in I start for yeah. an hour and I'm yeah. like I was just tired of me yeah, oh, yeah. bro if, I, if I'm in if I do yeah. a last set in London I get yeah. in like cuz we live near London yeah. so right I'm home in like 45 minutes yeah. I can't sleep. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's, when you do a Bristol, you've got that two and a half hours to, to so calm get down. tired for the last yeah, half yeah. hour. But you could, that, that adrenaline, that buzz you yeah, get on the yeah, set, man. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, can't yeah. sleep when you get in after that. that. Nah, exactly. That, listen, I, I get jittery if I don't work for a couple of weeks and I ain't yeah. like gigging and that's all I've done, isn't it? So I've it's a lifestyle thing, isn't it? It's a lifestyle. Yeah. So it's not even about the bookings or the money or whatever. Yeah. For me, it's just about being out there. And yeah. I get that, like, because I'm in a different position in my life, and my my missus understands that as well. Yeah. Like, I need that. Like, sometimes it's not about that. It's just about being out there. Yeah, active. And that's yeah, being active. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Because mm. if I'm doing family stuff at home all week and I ain't been out, and then I get a couple gigs at the weekend, this releases all my yeah, do you know yeah, what yeah, I mean? yeah. yeah. energy. Well, I love it, man. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. It's like football. We go football. We scream. You know well, that's it. Yeah, people don't understand. That's, yeah, I mean, like, that's, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, a that's release it. for me because I said to the, the missus like all you talk about is music yeah, and football and yeah. I'm like babe yeah. I could be down doing a line or I could be having a pint down the yeah, dog and duck <laughs> no what's it called lamb and flag the lamb and flag <laughs> sorry I forgot I could have been down the, the lamb and flag dog and duck yeah oh, <laughs> sorry yeah. I knew it was like that duck, you know. but the thing is is like look you know just like everybody goes through it. it even when you see people online and, yeah. and they look like they're having the most incredible life and that is usually Remember, it's just little moments that they're showing you. It's not, yeah. you don't see when they get off filming that their missus gives them a clip around the ear and tells them to, <laughs> you know, nah. pick up the dog's poo and all that. Do you know what I mean? But like we've real life we've, stuff. We've seen it with artists across yeah. the genres, haven't yeah. we, man, that have had like breakdowns and we, we think you're having the time of your life yeah. because there's certain stuff going on in the background. Yeah. It just isn't remember, always the case. Is, yeah. And but, just remember when you're, when you're doing all these things, you're not escaping. You're actually on a, you're because it's a journey, like mm. meditation. And you're even going to be, you know, being in green space. Mm. It's like good for your mental health. 
yourself. So mm-hmm. it's like with things like alcohol and other things like that and substances, it, it, it's not, you're just, you're holding it in still. You've still mm-hmm. got it inside you. Yeah. And you're just brushing it under the carpet. Mm-hmm. So like I you said, you come bro. out in different ways. So mm-hmm. when I done the Reiki, they said, yeah. oh, try not to drink alcohol today. Yeah. It's not, it, yeah. it doesn't help. You know what I mean? You've oh, just had the healing and it's, yeah. you put it, it's all, I can't, you probably know more yeah, than me. Yeah. But yeah, they yeah, said to me, no, nah, don't drink. And I did. Lots of water. You just drink water. Lots of water. That's what they say. Like you're going to be dehydrated after that because it literally will just clear loads of shit and then it could be stuff you're carrying from your childhood or losing a relative or whatever, do you know what mm. I mean? Or a close friend or whatever. Like even with Storman and Skibs, we all went through stuff, yeah, do you know what I mean? Yeah. My nan and that. So like I was carrying a lot of stuff as well, mm. stuff from when I was a kid as well. And that helps clear it. And you mm. think, right, I would never clear that. I would never known about that. Mm, yeah. And you don't so see it go and say bye. It's, it's, it's mad, man. Say... It's like when I did the Reiki, like first time, oh shit, I was very open and everything else. Yeah, Second yeah. time was just after Skibs passed and she said you could feel the blocked yeah, heart yeah. chakra and it was something yeah, going chakra, on. Yeah. Man bust tears after yeah, that. Yeah, I was yeah, crying, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, I mean, the first yeah. couple of times I went Reiki, yeah. four and a half years ago, me and my missus just sat there, floods were coming out yeah, and yeah. I weren't emotional crying. Like, oh, I'm sobbing. Yeah. Like, it was just coming out and it was yeah. weird. It's, and then, it's like, strange, and then after bro. that, it just clear stuff mm. and it becomes easy and then it becomes a thing. And Can I ask? I just um, fall asleep, bruv. Yeah. I fall asleep, literally. It I did that in the sound out. bath. I did that in the sound bath, but I thought I was I was kind of awake, but not yeah. awake. Yeah. It's a yeah. It's thing you, I went into. Between sleep <laughs> Mad, and, and bro. Try some of these Because you know why? We're all music. We've got music in our body. So when you hear the gongs and the music, it's like, Can I just ask? So for people that, like, you know, can't just make a phone call and pay 30, 40, 50 quid or whatever it is for these sessions. Mm. Is there ways for these people to go and get all of this online via YouTube yeah, or whatever? There's loads of stuff. You can type in meditations, you know, start, you know, peace, peace at your mind for your mind and whatever and sleep, and sleep things, you know what I mean? Do you but, think I definitely know the sleep thing works? That's yeah, definitely I, 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 I tell think, you. That. I think it's you've you got to really want it though. Yeah. Like if you really want to change and really want to do things and benefit and uh better your life then these things will help you they're tools mm. out there mm. and, and that's it like the same way that you can go to the out the shop and get alcohol or you can phone up your weed dealer and get this mm. or your, your, your coke dealer or whatever but yeah. you, you can go on youtube and just go like that and just type it so in, do, you know you, what I mean? do you think do you think like that there's like everybody like everybody should if they're feeling in any way sort of down or they're anxious about stuff they should do you think that they should try these things to try and kind 100% of, bro yeah. 100% I would ne- that's why I'm glad we got to talk about this because mm. for me like even holding it in like I want to express I don't want to be out there like I'm some guy that's yeah I just want to say you know what mm. it is cool mm. it is cool to do that do you yeah. get what I'm saying to you and you can still party you can still go out and do your thing or whatever mm. but mm. It, have a balance have it's a, a piece balance of, man that's yeah, what it is man. isn't it finding that do balance you know what I mean like, like I just choose to do for me what I choose to do and like you go church and other mm. people do shots runs mm. and everyone does their thing but mm. find something and you might come just do it and then you think right do you know what like, i feel good because to me the addiction is in the feeling mm-hmm. and it, it, i could talk to the cows come home mm. but when you feel how you feel the next day after doing all that mm-hmm. like one session of reiki could change your life brother and that would, i've never I'll, done that before bro i'm gonna, I'm gonna bring no. you man i'm gonna yeah. bring you i've, and I've Sharon, done it man. twice man it's I'm well worth i'm gonna it. bring yeah. you and yeah. sharon yeah because yeah. when they put they can literally put their hand over you and you can feel volcanic heat yeah. coming out of you yes yeah. like the shaman and all that yeah and they just yeah. hold your head and you fall asleep yeah because like, of the heat and yeah. you feel like do you know what <laughs> have you ever had have you ever had a massage yeah, 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 so like, yeah. Listen, I, do you know every time i go in a massage now apparently this is i, I don't know but you might be able to answer this when they're doing the massage i never relax all i'm thinking about is this is going to be over soon. This is uh, going to be over uh, soon. Ah, now you've got to lose yourself. Yeah, the whole time, yeah, bro. Yeah. All I'm doing is I'm going, yeah, she should go deep up. Yeah, this is going to load. Do you have problems it. relaxing in general? Big though, time. You, yeah, yeah. yeah, bro. <laughs> so, that's, the, that's one of the most relaxing experiences. Yeah, yeah. and I'm and just you're thinking, there, I'm oh, thinking, I like this, but it's going to be over. I, yeah, I, <laughs> yeah. All I'm thinking of, instead of living yeah. in the moment, I'm thinking about, it's going to be over soon. I, lo- I love aromatherapy oh, wow. massage, <laughs> but the, the tire massage, I went last week because I'm my back through driving and I did 14 hours driving, so I couldn't even move my neck. And I went to have a Thai massage, bro. 50 quid, bro. The woman beat me up for an hour. Oh, is that like a sports like, massage? Oh, I had that. Bro, they, similar they, to a sports massage? No, they, get on like... your, they get on your back. They oh, stand I know, on that, your that, back yeah. and they like, put their knees in yeah, you, bro. Like, bro. It was like... Hey, listen, I'll tell you one yeah. thing. I'll tell you, I had one of them once. I, well, I had one, me and Richard It's Rufus. not nice. It's not relaxing. Nah. Trust me. You bro, ain't going to see. Sports massage bro, isn't either, yeah. but it's this, good for your muscles, yeah, it's good isn't for your muscles. Yeah, yeah, this yeah, girl yeah. was about this tall, and she come in, and she was like, uh, do you want uh, medium, soft, or hard, or whatever? And I said, <laughs> I bet you went hard. hard. Yeah. <laughs> I said, hard. Beat you up. She mashed me up, bro. I actually oh, had a, I come God. out, I goes to Richie. Yeah. I goes, Richie, is my back supposed to hurt like this? He went, it will only be yeah. for a couple of days. But another thing I've got to tell you, um, I went, I never think this is so embarrassing, right? 
Um, so you know when they like lift up your legs and they push yeah, you and all yeah, that, yeah. and I went. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Man was dealing with the flatulence. Right? Listen, <laughs> listen, <laughs> oi, do you know what? Right, she said it weren't a silent no, and violent. No, one. no, no. She <laughs> turned around. She went loud and proud. She went, excuse me, <laughs> really. <laughs> Wait, bro, we actually, if you ever watched, sat, Ali G did that. He's he 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 a Ali G one. He did the same thing. Man, like party, didn't it? Like, yeah. and, and it, she would goes, "That's normal." <laughs> <laughs> Oi, but I was so. Do you know what? And guess what happened for the rest of the session? All I kept thinking about is, I can't believe I farted, uh -huh. I can't believe I farted. <laughs> and I couldn't get it out of my head. Oh, bro, that was it. Jesus. I was done. So I just wasted whatever it cost 30, 40 quid. It was oh just like God. because I didn't because feel, of that. I didn't feel relaxed. That after. one thing. Yeah. Let's hope you didn't have beans on toast for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> I had that this morning, buddy. For real? I, yeah, I, uh, for a lunch this afternoon. That's no. so weird you mentioned that. I Man. haven't had that for years. Man. Old school classics right there, boy. The Staple old diet. Classic. See, look, I'm mind reading now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that all good. But um, you know what? Uh, the reason we wanted to talk about this is because um, we are aware that, you know, there's, it, it's not just a music thing, but we are aware of some artists that are friends of ours that have mm. gone through some really tough times and... Mm. And, um, you know, and we wanted to kind of let them know that, you know, we're obviously thinking about them and there, there is a way out of it, you know, and people see what we do and they're like, oh, this is amazing and that. But there is, you know, don't forget, it's a moment in time. And then when we go home, we we have our normal lives like yeah. like you guys do. Real life problems, isn't it, man? Real life you know situations, I mean? yeah. you know I what I mean? And, all of that, man. and even though on the face of it, 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 it all looks like, you know, glossy and beautiful mm -hmm. and everything mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. That it's not always like that, do you know what I mean? And uh, you know, don't don't read too much into like social media, and that's why I think I really think they should be taking the likes off mm. and the stats because we do look at them. You know, I mean, as I said, I, you mm. know, it, and I think these things can affect. It's the same. Some people just come off for of social media. Do you know what I mean? That's what I've seen yeah. artists I see do. Just say, you know what? Well, say, I'm, I'm not. I'm coming off for a little while. And, I've yeah. done that. I've done that. You that know, and I'm back on that. It. Yeah, I did it. Mm. I actually did that. I come off it for a while, and then like I'm actually back on it now. So I don't know if you see my beautiful Bro, dance. I'll tell you what, what, I'm beautiful dance. You see that, Captain Bay? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh man, you need to watch the, that the one. The TikTok one. Say, oh, oh it's, it's on TikTok. I haven't seen it. I yeah, it's it on another, TikTok. There's another one I must have seen. Anyway, but, so me and my yeah. daughter, my daughter's doing a bit of work for me on the social media. She's like, she comes up with some really good ideas. So we went over the park and the weirdest thing is we were there for an hour and I had so much fun filming that with her. Yeah. That like, one. Yeah, and no, not that one. It's the other oh, one. It's actual dance. Yeah, it's actually oh, me dance. You have to go on TikTok and have a look. I, I've, you know what it is. I'm, I'm now doing different posts for different platforms. Oh really? Yeah. So I'll do, moving, yeah? I'll do my TikTok stuff and then I'll so do you can my, get more likes. Maybe. <laughs> 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 but no, the weirdest thing is this is this is how rubbish it is. You know that video, uh, that, the video we put of that security girl dancing yes. and me and you, and Nikki and that and X and um there was uh, that's got like three point two million like. Uh, thingies, yeah, uh, like, yeah, yeah, and then have you seen the one I've done with the little kid guy and his first words are all right, bruv? No, no I don't really go on TikTok. I'm no, terrible. no, no, that's oh, on Instagram, oh, Instagram. Right. bruv. It's got like yeah. 1.7 million thing, and then my next post has got like 7,000. Yeah, where does that, how does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, it does know, not make sense. I but I remember looking, going, Well, oh, I've got about I don't really, it's really weird. I don't watch mm. the followers, but on this day, I thought my numbers have jumped and I thought they actually went down. I thought, oh, I've, they've dropped yeah. a lot. And I looked and I see that. You I've just got to pull it out me. without having expectations. That's all it is as well. That's like, a good point. And if it happens, that's a great it happens. Point. It's bonus. I've that, got that's, posts that's that don't happen. Two, three hundred yeah. thousand and the other one's just like a couple of thousand. But yeah. you know what? I never expected that post to go there. Yeah, you yeah, know what yeah. I mean? yeah. I just like, you know what? I know what steady is. Yeah. Do you get what I mean? And yeah, that's it. Do yeah, you get yeah. what I mean? I can't, like 10,000 is steady on Instagram or whatever from me or 15,000. Yeah, that's yeah. cool. If it goes more than happy Bonus, days. Do you know yeah. what I mean? But yeah. I always find that like sometimes when you do this amazing plan mm. and you sit down and you strategize yeah. and you try and do this. I know it happened to me say, before. I had a meeting backfires. one time and it was some sort of big strategy thing was all planning and then I went off and said, I've just got to do a quick freestyle work for JDZ Media. Yeah. Jumped in the back of a car yes. in Wembley Video's got like millions of views. Yeah, I didn't even yeah. think about it. Yeah, the about one it. I didn't think about yeah. was the one that popped, and the, yeah, the other thing yeah, didn't really yeah. go anywhere. Yeah, that's how do you know what I mean? Like, and, that's, and it's like people at the have moment said that. is the best always for me. It's like the, the unplanned stuff is just organic and it just happens, isn't it? Do you know what yeah. I mean? If you expect it, oh, this is gonna go here and it don't, then you start getting deflated. Yeah, do you know what I mean, and anyone yeah. would. But that, that that that's that's a really good point you mentioned, deflated, because I think like sometimes like. I hope she don't mind mentioning. If she does, I'll ask her. I'll edit it out. But um, Wiser, she put so much love into a release that the insane release, mm. and it didn't perform as well as she wanted to. And I know that it really bothered her. She done like the sickest video. The video was cold. That's what I'm saying. She done yeah. so, and yeah. she really, really worked it. And then 
the other tune she done like the, a week after or two weeks after absolutely went mental and yeah, done really yeah, well and yeah. and sh and like so this is what i'm saying is like you know that, that's why what, what did you just say that made me think of that is like that deflated no, deflated yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. it's just a feeling that is a defeat that. Oh, bro, listen it don't matter what you're doing in life everyone gets that moment yeah, the music the music industry is a cutthroat industry yeah. like no matter what that's the game so yeah. to be an artist you've got to have certain things and shields up for that and yeah, know that yeah. you've got to deal with that yeah. so if you can deal with that and like i said it's all what you're doing as an individual because mm. some people just let it bother their their day their week their month their year or mm. other and it's, and other people just like you brush it off and just get on with yeah. it and well, work harder and yeah you know what i mean everyone's different isn't it man i think sometimes as well just for aspiring artists what you do have to remember is and it, it is cutthroat it's called the music business yeah. mm. it's not called the music love the music culture the mm. music yeah, all the, all the yeah, stuff yeah. that we love about it and yeah. why we got into it yeah it is the music business. Yeah. It is it is driven with by social media, by stats, yeah. by management teams, and all this mm. kind of stuff. So you've just kind of got to work your way through that minefield, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And not be deflated and just yeah. keep pushing, man, yeah. because you will get there. If you've got the talent and you've got the right sort of space to, yeah. to, to keep driving forward, you'll get there, man. So yeah. stick to your goals, innit? And just yeah. focus on your own goals and then try and knock them off like that. Do you know what I mean? Instead of watching other people, because other people could be just doing this and that. You just got to stick to what you know and, and have confidence and you'll get there. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah, because I think if you're there's a saying, man. If if you're watching everyone else, you're standing still. You're not yeah, watching. Yeah, you're, yeah, not, yeah, you know I mean? you're standing still. You're yeah, not moving. It, you're just watching it. everybody yeah. else. That's it. Yeah. That's it. And that's why, like, um, you know, another thing as well is I know it's really bad because I had a conversation with someone about this the other day, and I said like I try not to like I find that when I go on social media, if it's like. Um, Instagram or TikTok, I kind of just get sucked in for like an hour or, and then you've lost an hour. And then right. next thing you know, it's like, oh my God, I've got to do this and do that. <laughs> and I've just lost an hour. So I try not to go in uh, too much and have a look. But um, someone said to me recently, no, 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 you need to go in because you need to see what's going on. Mm. And I was like, bro, like I'll be in there for like, six seven hours if yeah, i keep yeah again it's a balance isn't it man yeah, do you know what i mean yeah. if you're on there for six hours that's not very productive do you know what i'm saying yeah. Yeah. did you do that six no hours? <laughs> I, I couldn't no, oh, but no, every no, now and again you, know, you could flip you could flip through and then you're just like yeah this and that but yeah. it's quite draining doing that as it, well like yeah. you could be at the greatest mood and see that and it's just draining yeah. do you know what i mean mm. i have a flick to see what we're uh, the industry that we're in and, and what's yeah. going on and what flies are out there whatever mm. i have a little yeah. flick and that's it really mm. like i'm mm. put my shit out there and just kind of just leave it um, but before, like, I was, I was. There was times I was just on my phone all the time. Do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah. Now mm. I just turn the vo my my phone's constantly got the volume off. Yeah, I don't mm. even hear it ping. Yeah, I mm. just look at it and say, oh, a couple of messages, I'll get yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. And it's mad. Like obviously, yeah. if we're out and we've got business, yeah. I will turn it on. But yeah, yeah. Mm. you know what I mean. Like, yeah. Apart from that, when I'm at home and I just leave it on, and then I just get back to people. Yeah, yeah. that's why sometimes yeah. I just message back. But I always do message yeah, back. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? But yeah. it's like. Yeah. I think there's a thing as well when you hear your phone pinging all the time. It's like, yeah, oh, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, the thing is, it's like, it's, it's mad because even on the computer, like the studio computer, you know, you get notifications keep coming up yeah, and yeah, it's yeah. so, you'll be doing something yeah. so distracted. You can't you're driving help. driving as well on my screen, it comes up when I'm driving. Like mm. if I leave the WhatsApp on, yeah. just like, bam, bam, and I can't even see the, yeah. How far I got to go, you know? Yeah, what I mean? yeah, yeah. Yeah, just, yeah. I leave so, my phone like this a lot. I just leave it yeah, that yeah, way yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? So that you can't, yeah. you know, so yeah. I'm not getting drawn in. Yeah. You know, but that's what I'm saying. It, bro, <laughs> honestly, you Come hear that. Me. You, yeah. Yeah. No, but you hear that ping and like, and it's so weird because like you could just be having the wickedest day ever and you get one message from someone oh. and it could just change the whole day and they carry on with their life like nothing's happened. Yeah. yeah and yeah. they've just like gone. Boom. Yeah, yeah. Just, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's when you get, you get, you know what I'm saying? Like Shot said, you, you're getting drawn in, but. Don't really, you know what I'm saying? You just, like you say, if you're busy and you've got shit going on, like, do you know what I mean? It's, you ain't got time for that. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Like, like, mm -hmm. I've, like, there's times where I just sit down doing nothing or whatever, mm -hmm. but come on, man. Like, in them times, it's what, What's valuable. that feel like? <laughs> it's, bro, <laughs> <laughs> bro, like, Honestly. I make time for that shit. Well, you, I did it. Yeah, I did I it. Do, I, after the busy bank holiday weekend, I actually thought that Monday, I'm still going to go yeah, gym. Yeah. Other than that, I'm doing nothing. nothing. Yeah, 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 I'm yeah, actually yeah. doing it because I've... The Tuesday or the Monday, because you're working Monday. Yeah, yeah. Like, you have to have that, man. You have to chill. Like, I even told the missus she's on the go all the time. Like, just chill out, please. Just chill out. It's You know what? I was Again, I was having this conversation with someone the other day about, um, you know, like over Christmas, I probably would do Christmas Day and then half a boxing day until the footy starts. And but I'm like I'm like clucking to get yeah, moving. Yeah, I can't. I, know, I just yeah, can't yeah, relax. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the whip it. The whip it. <laughs> the whip it, it huh? We call I'm, him the whip it because no, this no. guy moves super quick, yeah. man. He's the first one off the plane. First one through. Well, when his passport's <laughs> yeah, working. He's, he's, he's thinking. 
He's thinking about passport control when yeah, we, we're yeah. getting through um, our baggage and all yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> on it. He's thinking about the driver when we're. Yeah, no. Yeah, I know. You think ahead a lot, don't you? Yeah, I know, but it's <laughs> like I can't. That's good I though. It's not a bad thing, man. It. It's not I'm, a bad thing. I just I, my mind is always just moving like, like that. Yeah, like that, you need you, know to, you need to ch chill out as well. Yeah. You need like, sometimes we, we, you go 100 miles an hour. Yeah. Just chill out a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, I don't want to see you for a week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know well, what, though, man? I've actually seen you Wednesday. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Vibes, man. But this has been a good conversation. Yeah, man. I really, really enjoyed it, one, man. man. Really, you know what I mean, so we want to big up everyone who's been locking onto this podcast. Please share your thoughts on this yeah. subject, man. You share, know, share your it. experiences. Comments important. We read the comments, and you yeah. know what I mean, just keep it moving. And yeah, if you have got mental health and all that, try them things, man. You never know, man. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Mm. And things can help. I'm not saying they will cure everything, but do you know what. And we hope, most importantly, we hope by us discussing it, we've like helped you yeah, yeah, try to find it. Man, yeah, because you know it I mean? shouldn't be a taboo either. No, it no. should never be, nah, man, you know, yeah. it used to be like stiff upper lip and all them yeah, things yeah, back yeah. in the day. Oh, I can't cry, I can't, yeah. Pull my, yeah. can't show my emotions. Yeah. It should never be that because, yeah. like I said, it could come out in dangerous ways. Yeah. What we're trying to do as well is just put positive energy out there and just trying to like help people as well, like in, yeah. in the way that we know mm. to do best. Do you know what I mean? And, it's experience sometimes that can do that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And someone else talking or saying something. So, yeah, man, just just keep keep your head up and just keep it moving, man. Just keep strong and young artists as well. Just keep it active. Yeah, do you yeah. know what I mean. Well, we we I think it's a beautiful way. You yeah, summed it up it? lovely there, Shabs. Yeah, yeah, Ricky, you Shabs. <laughs> well, so listen, remember, leave your comments. Uh, if you like what we're doing, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so. It's, we keep this content coming for you and uh, remember to share, leave your comments, all of that. We do read them. We definitely like try to reply. We all take turns in replying and everything. Like that. And, and tell so, your friends about the podcast, man. Yeah, man, definitely. Tell them about it, man. We get a lot of good feedback on the road. So yeah. it's nice to get the well, feedback. That, that's wicked when people yeah. go. Do you know what the maddest thing is? I know we've said this all the time, but there's always people come up to me and I'm like, what? You listen to it. Yeah, like, yeah, people yeah. That, I'm like, I didn't yeah. even know you knew about us lot. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's yeah, like it's the most randomest it's good, thing. It's good, man. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, big love to everyone. Uh, big love to community. This is S A S A S A S signing out. Peace. Peace. Ta da. S A S A S A S S S. Beats and bars. Fresh, fresh, fresh. Done lower heavy. The best of the best of the best. So awesome if they're ready. Yes, yes, yes. S A S A S A S S S. Beats and bars. Fresh, fresh, fresh. Done lower heavy. The best of the best of the best. So awesome if they're ready. Yes, yes, yes.